Thank you very much, uh, Urs. I'm uh, absolutely delighted to be here with you um, uh, today in this uh, magical uh, moment. So dear, dear family, dear friends, alumni, faculty and staff, uh, also dear uh, speaker for our co commencement, uh, Aris, um, it is really my great pleasure to be here on this commencement ceremony of the Global Executive MBA of 2024. I want to, of course, extend a particularly warm welcome to all of you, the members of our Gemba class of 2024, for this very special day. Graduation is really a, a magic moment in academic life, one where the entire community gets together to recognize and celebrate the hard work, the resilience, and the passion that you've brought to this outstanding milestone. So your graduation is a tremendous achievement, and it is an honor for me and such a pleasure to be with you here today in Singapore, sharing this first day of this new exciting chapter of your life. And as Urs also mentioned, it's also a special day for me. Having only started in September, you are also my first graduates, my first graduation speech, which of course makes me particularly pleased to be here. And you are indeed a special group. And while we're here in Singapore celebrating, you have really traveled from all over the world to be here. Your truly global cohort is really a, a perfect representation of this unique and distinct nature of our program and the experience that we create. And you've heard about that already from Urs. And what's important is that each of you has brought something special to the group. Your personality, your culture, your competencies, your experience, your traits, your perspectives. And you have shared and learned through this uniqueness. And you've supported each other you know, and learned from each other through the strengths, these differences, and these challenges. And through that, you formed close ties. And I'm so absolutely confident that while you've learned a lot in the classroom, and Urs has made the point of you know, explaining how that has been so important, that you've also learned a lot from each other. And it's, in fact, a very important part of the secret sauce of INSEAD. And this brings this special understanding of working around people, around different cultures, and what the value that can bring to the community, to yourselves, to your job, to the outlook that you have. And today is not the end of your cohort journey. It's just the beginning of a different journey as a graduate. You will be moving into the next stage with a really powerful network of peers and friends from around the world. So do enjoy these lifelong connections that you have made with each other and with the school. Enjoy these amazing colleagues that you have here today. The opportunity to be here today all together is really unique and it's something that you'll cherish, that you'll remember. So do look around, do think about your colleagues, the friendship, the connectivity that you've had, because we'll come and we'll go with you towards your life. It's one of the distinctive elements of INSEAD, the strength and the power of these cohort relations. And that is throughout your lives and it's been one of the things that has impressed me the most as I joined this amazing community is precisely the strength and the connectivity that exists across the class of graduates from the MBA. But this wonderful group did not join just any school. You joined INSEAD. And for the benefits of your family and friends, just shared a little bit, a few words about the story, the mission, and the distinctiveness of INSEAD. INSEAD is indeed a very special place. A mission-driven school that really stays true to its founding values of diversity, independence, rigor and relevance, closeness to business, and entrepreneurship. And while I joined INSEAD just last September, in fact, 
I encountered the school the first time, its special characteristics, its special impact, a long time ago, in the 80s. I was at that time a teenager, a geeky tech teenager that went up to study physics as the first undergraduate degree, just to be very precise, way before I actually thought about business schools or even entering academia. At that time, my father, in his 40s, an executive from Portugal, where we were from, you know, this was six years after the Portuguese Revolution of 1974. Portugal was opening up. There was not a lot of global or international experience for the young executives. And my father had the opportunity to go to INSEAD and to do a long executive program that had an indelible mark on him, the knowledge, the experience, the colleagues, many of the elements that made your transformational journey was present in his mind, in his spirit, and in his career. And I remember as a young teenager, as my sister with whom I discussed that, which were the only ones of our siblings who had any age to comprehend what that could have been, the impact that it had on his life, on his career, and through them in us. And in fact, that got reminded to me 40 years later, because it turns out that having the same name as my father, when they tried to put my name in the system of INSEAD, the response was that, in fact, there was already a Francisco Veloso that had been here in the 80s, and they had to change the file and update it to the new experience. And in fact, this experience, this perspective, it was what very much is present since the founding of INSEAD in 1957, inspired by George Dorio, at that time a French professor at Harvard Business School, at a time that, of course, other schools already existed in France and in Europe. But his vision was just not just to bring cutting-edge business education to Europe, but also to bring together people from different countries and to really contribute to building peace and prosperity in Europe following two bloody world wars, and to do that through business understanding, through business exchange, and through leadership. And of course, we have evolved and grown over time. We've established campuses around the world, of course, here in Singapore and in Abu Dhabi and the hub in San Francisco. We've gained global recognition and impact. But most important, INSEAD is mission-driven. We have remained true to the vision of our founders and to our mission of bringing together people, cultures, and ideas to develop responsible leaders who transform business and society. And there are many other schools out there that are very good at teaching about management. But we're really the only one who is a truly global business school, the only one that brings together the people from all over the world in a classroom where is the, there is no dominant culture. Everyone is a minority at INSEAD. And today's INSEAD's mission is more important than ever. And we're always innovating and looking at our future. Our award-winning faculty have been creating pioneer research that is making a fundamental difference to the way that companies address relevant topics from AI to circular economies to the future of work. We, of course, frequently re-engineer our curriculum to make sure that it addresses key topics from sustainability to digital transformation and many others. We collaborate with fellow business schools and global organizations from the UN to address issues such as climate change, gender inequality, or sustainability. And we are ensuring that business leaders are equipped with the skills to integrate social and environmental issues into their business decisions. But this gets, leads me to another very important element, which is your responsibility. The world has changed a lot since 1957. The next stage of your journey is at this crucial time in history. The first rate of digital transformation has a huge impact in the business world. When you started, ChatGPT was not in our vocabulary. Today, many of us are doing a daily use of this technology. The speed of global warming is accelerating, and there's momentous times to make happen. 
including the recent COP28, which can be a big possibility, but it depends a lot on what we do on the back of that agreement. ESG or DEI are key elements for any business leader that needs to be incorporated in the way that they decide and the way that they think about the outlook of their companies. The world is experiencing war and migration in many governments are becoming more inward looking. And despite this challenging and sometimes sobering context, I remain optimistic. And that is thanks to you, the Global Executive MBA Class of 2024. After all, you just completed your GEMBA program at INSEAD, the business school for the world. And this is a special group graduating at a special moment. The school prepares leaders to deal with business and societal issues responsibly, ethically, with sound judgment, to make a positive impact. And in today's polarized world, we need to bring people together more than ever to collaborate, to dialogue, to communicate, to drive impact. It has never been more urgent. And that's what you've experienced through the diversity of your group, the knowledge and expertise of your world-leading faculty, and the relevance of your curriculum. So as graduates of INSEAD, you carry a great responsibility. You're unique and you have a privileged position, one with the potential to make a great impact on business and society, on people's lives. You're equipped with the knowledge, the tools, not only to navigate the world in this challenging context, but to lead others responsibly with a vision to make the world a better place. The challenges of today cannot be solved with yesterday's thinking. We can no longer rely on government and NGOs alone to fix the world's problems. Business has a crucial role to play. It must drive positive change. We need leaders equipped with the right tools, knowledge and values. Leaders who understand the challenges and the opportunities we face, who lead the change with the new ideas and new ways of doing business. And this is what the unique GEMBA program has helped you prepare for, to take your role to be one of these leaders. This is your responsibility. This is your opportunity to make a difference in the world. I encourage you to remember what you have learned here at INSEAD about the potential for business to drive positive change. I want you to use the knowledge that you've acquired and take that knowledge back to your companies, to your communities, and use it to bring about change. You have an outsized role to play in transforming the world, an outsized responsibility to lead by example. I urge you to continue your journey while helping to build back a more equitable and sustainable society. But you are not alone. As you step forward into the world as proud graduates, remember that you're now part of a global community of over 68,000 INSEAD alumni in 180 countries, a global community of leaders as yourselves. No other business school has the breadth and the depth and the diversity of alumni community such as ours. This expansive network is not just a testament to our shared history. It is a vibrant, active community ready to support you in your future endeavors. Beyond your fellow graduates, I encourage you to engage with your National Alumni Association, attend events such as the annual Alum Alumni Forum. I urge you to embrace this powerful resource. Do not hesitate never to reach out to your fellow alumni for guidance, for mentorship, and for collaboration. But also give back and consider volunteering and giving back to the community and the school in some capacity. The more you engage, the richer your experience will be. This is the secret sauce of INSEAD, a network that grows in value as you contribute to it. Let's continue to build this legacy together, fostering a community that thrives on mutual support and a shared vision for a better world. The future of the world depends on you. I look forward to hearing your stories of success in the future, you, the class of GEMBA 2024. And do stay in touch with us. We are fully vested in your success and not just in your personal success stories, but the stories of how you're carrying INSEAD's mission forward, about how you make INSEAD's value your own. 
to make a positive impact on business and society. I have no doubt that you will change the world for the better. It won't be easy, but I have faith in you because you are in SEAD. Congratulations and all the best to the amazing Executive MBA class of 2024. Thank you, Francisco, for your, for your uh, um, impactful speech and your first speech, and uh, it's really good. Uh, <laughs> and I love, the, I love your personal connection to INSEAD. So. Uh, it is now my great honor to introduce your distinguished alumni speaker. Here is Zemzum Gemba, 2008. So she's been in your seat a few years ago. Uh, she's now heading the Asia-Pacific, Middle East, and Africa business for Novartis and is based here in Singapore. With a passion for accelerating access to innovative medicines and placing patients at the heart of her mission, Iris leads the charge in driving innovation, growth, and productivity for Novartis in this region. Known for her exceptional leadership skills, Iris has an impressive track record for building and mobilizing high-performance teams and cultivating a purpose-driven culture. Prior to joining Novartis in October 2020, Iris made significant contributions at Bristol-Myers Squibb as brand lead and later as general manager Switzerland. At Janssen, she held positions such as Vice President of EMEA, Strategy Organization, and General Manager in Germany. Before immersing herself in the pharmaceutical world, Iris was a dedicated physician consultant at the Department of Obstetrics and Gynecology in the University Hospital Tum in Munich. Her commitment to improving patient outcomes extended beyond her clinical practice as she also served as a co-investigator in breast cancer therapy trials. In addition to her medical expertise, Iris holds an executive MBA from INSEAD and this diverse educational background equips her for a unique blend of medical knowledge and business acumen, allowing her to approach her role with a holistic perspective. Please, Help me welcome Iris back to INSEAD on on stage. Thank you.